soldiers of Task Force Arctic Wolves are heading home after spending the last 12 months deployed in southern Afghanistan. A special task force was established with the sole purpose of planning the redeployment process. Task Force Breakout is the command and control structure that the brigade has sent back here to Kandahar Airfield to redeploy all of the soldiers and equipment to Fort Wainwright, Alaska. The first step of the redeployment process has been ongoing for the last month as soldiers began packing equipment into containers to be sent back to Alaska. The packed containers are then transported back to Kandahar Airfield. After arriving in CAF, soldiers make the necessary preparations to get the containers back to the states. Right now our, our purpose is we got units at other FOBs and we're waiting on their equipment to get here. Uh, we get it through customs, we ensure that all the connexes and everything are clean, uh, ensure that the members are right to process, to ship out, to get us back home. The second step of the process involves getting the soldiers from Afghanistan back to Alaska. Basically, once, once all of the soldiers have been manifested, they'll get on their aircraft and fly from here to Manus Air Force Base. From there, uh, they'll hold for a couple of days until their uh, flights are ready, and then they will fly back to Isleson Air Force Base. Once there, they'll be met by our uh, rear detachment cell, in processed back into Fort Wainwright, and sent home to their families. While this process includes a lot of downtime and waiting for the soldiers, most say they don't mind as long as it gets them back home. And I look forward to see my family, drinking a beer, having some home cooked meal, you know, just, just getting down back on U.S. soil. Right. Twelve months of this, it's time to go, it's time to go. Army PFC Andy Geisler, Kandahar, Afghanistan.